A big update for OBS is currently in beta. While this update brings a lot of changes, one of the things that interests me is that the AMF encoder has been re-implemented. What this means is that AMF can not only look better, but also perform better when encoding with an AMD card now. Or at least this is true only if you own one of the latest GPUs that AMD makes. With my Vega 56, B-frames are not supported. B-frames actually add a lot to the quality of the recording, so them being missing is actually going to hurt quality. But there have been various improvements in the previous version of AMF, so I still thought that it may be worth trying. There are also a lot more features that have been improved since, but the various documentations are pretty unclear as to which GPU supports what, especially OBS's. Although AMD's was all over the place and hard to find in the first place, but after looking through OBS's logs, I noticed that pretty much every feature that improved quality was missing from my graphics card, and that instead they were locked to Adina 2 and some to Navi. Since this is a re-implementation and that AMF got updated since the last version, I still decided to give it a try. For my testing, I recorded a lossless source video with OBS, then played it back through OBS itself and made an auto hotkey script to consistently record the same footage. I also extracted some frames using FFmpeg to compare them later. The first test was running around in DAISY, which is very demanding bitrate wise due to all the grass around. At 1080p 60fps and a bitrate of 3600, X264 medium scored a 12.1 VMF score, old AMF did 11.1 and new AMF did a score of 12, upping the bitrate to 8000, X264 medium did 18.1, old AMF did 12.1 and new AMF did just 12. Daisy is a very hard game to encode, so I didn't really expect much difference here, either that or massive one. Another game I tested is a bit easier to encode, which is GTA 5. The test was driving to the city, then ending on a beach, which is easier to encode due to its lack of detail. At a bitrate of 3600, X264 is 52.9, Old AMF did 41.4 and new AMF did 41.5, which isn't very different. And with a bitrate of 8000, X264 did 74.8, old AMF did 64.9, and new AMF did the exact same score. Rocket League, which is a lot easier to encode, seems to be an outlier, as new AMF seems to perform a point better than old AMF at a bitrate of 3600, X264 did 62 while old AMF is 31.8 and new AMF is 32.7 and with a bitrate of 8000 the results were 81.9, 67.6 and 68.1. Overall there's pretty much no difference between the old and new encoder. The only GPUs that truly benefit from this update are the latest and obviously most expensive ones.